Recently on Funnel Cut Grill episode six, I was talking with Anthony Moreshi, and one of the topics that we touched on was moving motion templates between different machines. And if you look down here over in the title browser, you can see that uh, there's a few settings down here that might look unfamiliar. There's one for Autodesk, and there's one for this company called DeLeon. These are companies that we do work for here. Now, if I step out into the Finder by hiding this guy and then starting a new window, I want to show you where those templates are stored. If I go into my Home folder, my Movies folder, if we come down here, there's a folder called Motion Templates. When I open that up, you can see I have compos uh, compositions, effects, generators, and titles. Now, if you notice this, here's one of the ones I mentioned, which was Autodesk, and here's another one. This is the company that I mentioned that we have, uh, that we do work for, this company called DeLeon. It's a real estate company. Now, when I open up a second folder, and I can reach into another machine in our office. So we have multiple edit suites here in Edit 3. There's a machine... Um, called slice 13 and we number all the machines and if i come into the movies folder here and motion templates you can see in my titles folder i don't have all the same stuff and that's because this template was made on this machine but not necessarily shared with this machine to share it it's literally as simple as this drag it over drop it in and the next time you look for a title in that um, version of Final Cut in the other room, it will be there. As a matter of fact, sometimes you don't even have to relaunch the software. If you don't see it, relaunch the software, everything will be fine. So that's how you share motion templates between machines. Later.